He was considered the most significant culture icons of the 20th century and was simply known as the King. Last week, the Burlington 4th of July Committee held a fundraiser at the American Legion Hall featuring a very special guest, Elvis. Fourth of July Committee holding our annual fundraiser. This year, we're fortunate enough to have Burlington's own uh, Stan Anderson, uh, the Stan Jr. show. Stan's been doing this for, oh goodness, many, many, many years. Uh, he's, I don't know, 40 years, maybe more. Um, he's, he's very entertaining. I think the people here will really enjoy it. The committee had a lot of preparations before the event could kick off. You know, just some creative thinking of, amongst the committee. You know, we're a very small committee. We only get six or seven of us that, you know, show up on a regular basis. Uh, and, uh, you know, someone come up with the uh, idea of maybe Stan would come back because he was here in November doing a class reunion uh, last year. Somebody mentioned it, what, a, what a great show he put on. So we asked uh, Gary Cornwell to reach out to Stan, see if he's willing to come back and help out the uh, 4th of July committee. And being a Burlington guy, he was happy to help. Stan Anderson, a.k.a. Stan Jr., is an American performer and entertainer who is best known for his career as an Elvis impersonator. Well, uh, I know Gary, uh, you know, and, and uh, he approached me uh, to, uh, uh, you know, if I would be interested in uh, putting on a show uh, here at the American Legion and, uh, you know, try to raise money for the American Legion. It's a great, great idea, you know, so uh, I was all for it. You know. The 4th of July committee is already in the process of reaching out to the business community. However, donations are lower this year. This being our first event of the year, we're really going to get into the, the, the meat and potatoes of the fundraising, reaching out to our corporate neighbors, uh, you know, throughout the month of May and June and so forth. You know, we've, we've had some, some very good corporate uh, neighbors here in Burlington. We're very fortunate, um, but we could always use a few more. But, but you know what, these are the same people that you know, not only step up and, and help us here with the 4th of July parade, but the, the people helping people programs, the rec re recreation events we have on the common. It's these, it's, it's, you know, oftentimes it's these same corporate citizens that we have here in Burlington. So we'd like to get a few additional corporate citizens and uh, bring them into the fold. The committee is always looking for new volunteers to help out with the parades and fundraisers. Well, they can visit our website www.burlingtonjuly4th.com or we're also on Facebook. They can, they can reach out to me through the Selectman's office or any one of our members um, if they want to volunteer. We're always looking for volunteers. Uh, we're currently uh, um, uh, seeking nominations for a Citizen of the Year. We've had three or four already, so we're, we're already ahead of the game. We don't usually get that many. So we're getting a little bit better at this. This is our fifth year running the parade, so we've, uh, you know, we're always learning from our past and uh, each year it gets a little bit better, a little bit easier for us. The committee is always grateful for the community to come together and help out. They're, they're contributing to a, to a great cause. As you know, on the 4th of July, you guys cover the 4th of July parade for us. And, and since we've uh, the addition of the fireworks for the last couple of years, I mean, we've got thousands of people uh, along the parade route and thousands more come out to the common. And uh, it costs a, costs a lot of money to do that. So I appreciate the support we have here tonight. And anyone home listening wants to help out, they, you know, we would welcome that as well. Finally, the performer says he is always happy to see the audience enjoy his show. As far as taking away from my show, an enjoyable evening. You know, uh, something that they can, you know, wake up tomorrow and say, wow, we had a great time last night. And, you know, that's, that's my, you know, um, my job is done. You know, because that's what I enjoy doing. I, 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 I like bringing uh, a smile and enjoyment to the audience. From the American Legion Hall, I'm Robert Paris for B News Weekly.